G'day, uh, you can't see me, but you can hear me, and probably you can hear me really clearly, I hope. But here am I, about 15 metres away from the smartphone, which has got a, a Rode Video Micro shotgun mic on it, and you can hear me really well. You're not hearing me through the Rode mic, because if you were hearing me through the Rode mic, I would sound like this, pretty distant and pretty low, but I sound like this. And that's because I'm using a wireless system, not an $800 or a four, even a $400 radio mic. I'm using a homemade radio mic. And the way you, the way you do that is that you take an old microphone like a SmartLav Plus and, uh, and an old, old iPhone and uh, you switch them on and you switch your smartphone on. You make a, uh, a clap for reference. And then you start, hi, my name is Evo, and I'm taking part in this tutorial to show you how to create a radio microphone wireless system without spending any dollars. And what you do then is that you switch both phones off, you uh, airdrop the file from this phone, which is a video file, across to the other phone, um, and then you start a new iMovie project you import your vision into the iMovie project, um, which is quite easy. You then uh, extract the audio and you then sync up the claps. Reference. Just shuttle back and forth using the clap as a reference uh, until you get the voice in sync. You might need to do it a few times back and forth, but eventually it'll be right in sync. Wireless system without spending any dollars. When you're finished, switch off the audio on the top vision track and you're left with a good smart lav, cheap wireless but excellent audio from the bottom track. And there you have it, an in sync radio mic that sounds just like this. Very cheap, it cost me the price of a, a smart lav uh, and it's um, an old phone that I had lying around. You've just got to have airdrop. If you don't have airdrop, you can use Airstash or one of the other devices to get your file across. There it is. Very, very cheap and very easy way of doing good wireless audio. And the trick is, the truth is, it's actually got a much better range than even wireless microphones. You can go back three, four, five hundred metres. It won't matter. And you can run in. It'll be just fine. So there you go. And what, what is it that we used to do back in the days when we used to use this type of stuff? We used to call it an N-clap. Go Mojo.